Nikiti Nambia, political analyst, also joins us. So, Mr. Nambia, uh, Dora Swami has uh, been, uh, you know, he's made uh, certain comments in the past against the Prime Minister as well. He's spoken against V. Savarkar as well, and he, he's uh, an all out, a very open. Uh, you know, opponent of uh, the CAA as well. Do you think that was perhaps the reason that we got to see what we saw today in the Karnataka Assembly? I am of and the is that right? No, uh, firstly, I am of the opinion that if you don't like somebody's comment, so you immediately call, go and call him as a Pakistan agent, may not be in the right spirit. That may not be the way we uh, in our politics should be, con uh, we should be conducting our politics of uh, today. Having said that, if you really look at in the south of India, especially since I uh, hail from uh, the state of Kerala, there has also been a trend in the south of India that portraying some people larger than life kind of an image, wherein they have been given such kind of a stuff that they are uh, the, the, the biggest freedom fighters. You know the controversy about the Tipu Sultan, how many millions of Hindus he has been butchered across, he has broken so many temples, but then he has been given such kind of a heroistic uh, view in the education side everywhere. Even in the school uh, curriculums, he has been treated as a hero, whereas the history clearly says that the, he has killed so many Hindus, converted a large number of people. Same way, if you really look at it in the same way, uh, Mopila Lehala, which is called as the Muslim rebellion in the Khilafat, uh, is, is things in the Kerala, 1921, it is also now treated as more of like, wherein millions of Hindus have been either converted or butchered, he has been treated as a freedom fighting. I, I can only say that this, the double standards of creating heroes from nowhere, I think a lot of time the BJP MLS, people like them also give such kind of an opportunity to create. Mr. Dureswami, at his, uh, he, he has the uh, all kind of a rights to go against the CAA. Nobody can question if he wanted to go against the CAA. But it is also important to know the anti-CAA protest across the country. We have clearly seen it has been completely motivated, without even knowing what it stands, what, without even. Uh, telling the people that w whether the CAA is going to take away anybody's citizenship. Nobody, no opposition leader, no people who are protesting has been able to convey that to anybody till today that whether the citizenship of any Indian who is residing in India other than the people who are infiltrated to this country will be affected. But I think there are times we unnecessarily create controversies and people like to, the, the politicians knowingly or unknowingly do get into it. But only one thing I must tell, that we tell you all of, uh, of you, is that the South of India is trying to make a lot of heroes wherein they were all real villains. Whether it is a Tipu Sultan, whether it is a Mopila uh, rebellion, which has happened in the 1921, where the Hindus were clearly butchered all across, have been now treated as freedom fighters and heroes. I think this also needs to end. We mm. need to go back to